What is going on everyone? Today we're going to be watching and reacting to Arcane Season 1 Episode 3, which is titled The Base Violence Necessary for Change. Well, I mean, there you go. They were just talking about that last episode, the fact that they felt like they needed to go, uh, you know, actually fight the Enforcers to make change. And Vander was very much against that, uh, but uh, clearly a lot of the other characters were not. They wanted to fight, and so I think we're going to get to that point soon. It seems like Vi is already doing something to, you know, start that. Uh, so yeah, let's just jump right into this episode. If you want to see the full cut reaction, that'll be my Patreon. It'll be in the description down below. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel. Let's watch. Oh, someone's Everyone drowning. Know what it's like to drown. There's peace in water. Like it's holding you, whispering in low tones to let it in, and every problem in the world will fade away. But then, there's this thing in your head. Oh my god. For that, I thank you, old friend. Old friend? Was that Vander? I don't know, it looked like Vander outside of that. I don't know. But yeah, that was the guy, the mad scientist guy, right? Oh, what? Oh, it wasn't the Enforcers? <laughs> I'm proud of you. Always have been. Well, they're on their way. Protect the family. What are you... Uh... No! Wait, so it wasn't Vi that sent it? It was Vander? Vander! Oh, shit! I'm guessing that's for me. Are you gonna let us make the arrest or not? Vander... You'll oblige a doomed man one last smoke. Oh, I'm assuming he said that he was the one who did it. I'm not putting you away, Amanda. The council needs its pound of flesh. Without you down here, it all falls apart. Benzo will handle things. Vander, no! You won't be coming back for a long time. Oh, shit. <laughs> what?! What the fuck is happening? Oh, <laughs> what? I, dude, she got demolished. Oh shit! It's it's that it's the yeah the I don't know their names, but well the mad scientist guy yeah I'm, I'm calling him that because I don't know his name. <laughs> oh Silco yeah okay. Go crawl back in your whatever hole you came out of. Then just be stay careful! Back. Be careful! Wait! Oh my god! Holy shit! Mm, stubborn to the end. Yeah, and that's that kid that he gave the purple thing to. Oh yeah, that guy was. Yeah, I forgot he was working with him. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god. No, not Vander. Fuck. Oh, I didn't even think about this. No. I like my brain wasn't even computing that Vander's there right now. He's gonna get killed. Well, he's not dead. I don't think that killed him, right? Did it? It might have. I don't know. That was a hard punch. Oh no, he's taking him. Maybe he didn't kill him. Holy shit! Yeah, he, he was not expecting them to wipe out Grayson. And uh, oh my, that was insane. So is he dead? I don't. He got punched hard as hell, though. I I don't. I'm gonna assume not because he's taking him. But I don't know. That was a great scene. Well, we could test it if we had access to my equipment, which is being destroyed tomorrow. That research is everything. My my uh, my whole life. Maybe if we showed them the equations, they'd let no, us. We need more than promises. We need proof. Not without the crystals. The enforcers took them all. They're gone. Yeah, locked away in Heimendinger's lab. No, no, no. You heard the count. <laughs> if we're wrong, got to be right then. I saw everything. Bet, bet so. They. Yeah, man, that was that was insane. They, they, they took him. Yeah, so he's not dead. I'm glad he isn't dead because I, I really liked Vander, so I don't want to see him die this soon. It's a little crude, I'll admit. The base violence necessary for change. Oh wow, that's so interesting. I was expecting that title to be in reference to them feeling the need to fight back using violence, but it was actually the villain well, that said it. I don't have to. I just need to scare them. 
They will dare set foot in the underground again. So yeah, he's part of the underground. He's not part of Piltover. We shared a vision, Vanda. A dream. Interesting. I didn't know they all knew each other, but yeah, I guess they do. Do you even remember? I trusted you. And you betrayed oh, me. Oh yeah, that, so that was Vander at the beginning then. What I did to you, I've never forgiven myself. You are my brother. No, you still don't understand. Can you imagine what it's like when your blood mixes with the filth and the river toxin Z3? Oh shit, that's why his eyes like that? Oh, I hated you for what you'd done. Holy shit. But as time passed, so did my hate. And I was left with an understanding. The only way to defeat the superior enemy is to stop at nothing. To become what they fear. I hated you, but you kept my respect until you made peace with them. Oh, uh, that's what he's so against. I had no choice. But now you do. Shema, we have the power. In fighting topside, you'd sacrifice everything that we are. It's not the way. I always love villains like that. The ones that are like very extreme versions of the main characters like the, he, they have he has a similar goal to are the main character the, the main protagonist but he's so extreme with it that it ends up he ends up becoming a villain kind of like koba from the planet of the apes trilogy so far so good willing to risk exile for your endeavor that's quite the conviction the counselor wait a minute uh, what a surprise my bedroom <laughs> <See you. laughs> we can prove that it works hmm. You couldn't do so earlier today. How is tonight any different? We figured out how to stabilize it. Even if you managed to prove your theory, the council would destroy it. Don't let them destroy it then. It scares him. It scares them all. Yeah, that's true. It's not necessarily that they don't believe in it. They're just, they think it's going to be dangerous. Counselor, this technology, it's real. And no matter what happens here, it's going to change our world. We should be the ones to lead it. Piltover, the land of progress. She's going to cover for them. One night, gentlemen. Impress me, or I'd suggest you pack your bags. <laughs> Aww. She always looks sad. Oh, now she's happy. They don't know what happened to Vander, though, right? Slow down. Benzo's dead. Dead? They took Vander. Who took Vander? I don't know, but I need to help him. We're going with you. Whatever killed Benzo was like nothing I've ever seen. It tore him apart. You're not doing this alone, Vi. He's our father, too. Wow, I didn't realize they literally call him their father, even, you know? I, I, like, I, obviously, it was a kind of implied that that was the dynamic they had, but I didn't realize they would even use that as a thing to call him. It's too dangerous. But family stick together. You said it yourself. I know what I said. I want to fight. I can help. You're not ready. Damn. It's not even that she's not ready. I mean... She's she's saying it because she doesn't want to see that happen to her. I don't blame her. That was insane. If they come for you, take this and run. Wherever you are, light it up and I'll find you. I promise. I don't think it's gonna hold. Look at the build up. Trust me. Oh my god. Oh, she's got the bunny holding them. <laughs> oh shit. Dude, there's some, like, the animation always looks amazing, but some scenes, they go extra hard with it. Oh, shit! You do not want to do that! What is she thinking? I can help them. With those bombs? I mean, you could, but, like, what are you gonna do with them? Let's get Vander and get out. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Oh. Is it? Oh, it's just sending the... I thought it was gonna bring time backwards and put the window back together. <laughs> but it just sent the freaking glass shards right at them. Damn. Fine. All right, no, no time for hugs. Let's get the hell out of here. How did you get in? There's guards everywhere. It was easy. We found an open window and... Oh, God. 
You have to get out. Now. Welcome. Oh shit. Oh shit. I feel like one of them's not making it out of here alive. Have you heard the rumor? Vander the coward fled town with his children. Oh my god. Clagger, see if you can find another way out. Oh, she's got the she got the fist thing. <laughs> she's been practicing, right? She, she I mean she's she's a pretty good fighter. Is she gonna be able to take on all ten of those people? I, I don't know, but we'll see. Is she gonna yo, is she gonna throw those little blue grenade things? <laughs> right, Cause she could she could throw it at them at, at like the crowd of them and that, that'll do a lot of damage. Oh nice. Damn those fists are cool. Oh Holy shit, this looks insane. Oh my god. <laughs> We're gonna get you out. He's gonna break through that? Damn! <laughs> Did that guy cut his tongue with the knife? He went like like that at a I don't know. Ready to rise to the surface. Oh my god. She can't fight that though. She she can't fight that. That's Oh my god. Those blue things are gonna have to they're they're gonna have to be the way to stop him because I, I what are you gonna do? Oh. <laughs> Holy shit! Oh! Oh my God! Oh. Let go! Let it go! This is between you and me. You had your chance. Damn! <laughs> oh! Oh no! She got it! She got it! Dude, this episode is crazy, man. Oh my god. You did good. She almost died, though. Open up! Stop Open up. this lunacy and whip! Get on the throne! Oh, shit. Oh, shit. What the hell? Excuse me, underfoot. <laughs> His mustache is floating. <laughs> done it. But just because it can be done doesn't mean. Oh, come on. Will you please stop hovering? <laughs> no, like, this I get it, though. Like, it is a dangerous thing, clearly. Like, my dear boys. That's for the council to decide. Oh, nice. Yeah, she seems to be down Perhaps for it. Perhaps it's time for the era of magic. Uh, Hextech. For the era of Hextech. He's not having it. <laughs> he's like, fuck, dude. This he's he's seen the dangers of it. Oh, she's using her little toys. You have to work for me. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, <laughs> oh, that's so cool. Oh shit. <laughs> is it not working? Oh no. Don't tell me it didn't work. Oh, oh, there you go. Oh, oh shit. Oh, you better not die. Oh. Did that just tear, did that just tear her apart? Oh, oh my god! That one thing did all that? It's just, it's gonna keep going. It's just gonna keep going. They gotta get the hell out of there, because they're like two feet away from it. Well, they're on the other side of a big metal door, though. Oh, oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? Oh my god! Did that just kill him? What the fuck? 
yeah this shit ain't good you can't you, you can't this shit ain't good and now the enforcers are going to be using it well piltover is oh my god holy shit dude powder i mean you were oh my god and this thing is still alive it didn't even kill it it did it, did, it didn't even kill it are you kidding me oh my god What the fuck? <laughs> oh, hell yeah. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Alright, I, I get the hype with the show now. I get I get the hype. I get it. No. Holy shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. What the fuck? Oh my god. I like this might be one of the most insane episodes of any TV show I've ever seen. Holy shit. He did land on the purple stuff. I don't think that means I think he's dead. I think he's dead. Oh my god. Well, maybe not. I don't know if he drinks that purple shit right now. I mean, it's 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 probably not good for you, but it'll help you in the moment. I would I would do it. Dude, this episode's been such a roller coaster between whether or not Vander's gonna die, but I can't believe I fucking Oh my god. The two boys died, right? Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, oh my god, Vander. He's like the Hulk. He was already a big dude, so... He's gonna get her out of there, nice. Oh my god, dude, I, like... The first two episodes were good, don't get me wrong, but, like, I... I get why this is considered, like, such an incredible show. That This episode, it... This just, 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 just grabbed me in. Like, this, 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 I don't know... They caught me in their fucking bait right here, man. This is a, a fantastic episode. I'm I'm all in now. Take like I'm. Oh, he's gonna die, dude! The back and forth, man! What the fuck? <laughs> they had us thinking he was gonna live, and then he wasn't. And then... oh my god! I don't think she's ever gonna forgive Powder. I don't think she knows she knows it was Powder because she saw the little toy. I don't think she. I think Powder lived, right? I mean, she fell out a fucking building, but oh what? shit! What? No Powder! <laughs> oh my. Me? God! My finally worked. Oh my God! You did this. Oh my God! Why? Why did you do this? I did. I did. I was saving you. What the fuck? Oh, they wanted to help. <laughs> oh my God! I only wanted to help my own. I told you to stay away. I told you to stay away! Oh my god! Why did you leave me? Because you're a jinx! Do you hear me? Milo was right! No, 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 no. Milo, please! What are you gonna do, dude? Is he gonna take her? Dude, no. What the fuck? 
fuck? How are like all those dudes still alive? I don't know. Where's your sister? <laughs> yeah, I think he's gonna take her. She left me. Oh, don't tell me she's gonna eventually like grow a fondness to him. Is that the direction they're she going in? Not my sister. Oh my god, powder, but like I mean she shouldn't have hit you, but like you you did kind of fuck up there, even though she was just trying to help. But that shit was really dangerous. It's okay. Oh my god, they are gonna go that angle. Oh my god. Someone did mention that this the show is split up with like arcs, kind of like uh, what the Clone Wars does. So I think they said every three episodes is like an arc. And yeah, that clearly seems like the end of an arc there. Oh my god. So, I mean, like I said, the first two episodes were solid. Like I, I enjoyed them. It was a good introduction of the characters, but I, I didn't think it was like, oh, this is insane or anything. I, I get it now, though. Like, <laughs> I fully get why this has been so hyped over the past couple of years ever since it first came out. I fully understand it now. This is honestly... I mean, if I were to sit down and rank, like, my favorite TV episodes, this is probably in the top 50, top 100. At, at least, man. This is... Holy shit, that was insane. Just... I mean... I think what I like about it so much is that... What Powder did there, right... You can kind of look at it in two different ways where if she didn't do that, it could have either been worse or better for them. And we don't really know. That's the thing, which is why I think it makes it an interesting scenario. Because, yes, she did help them in a sense, but she also made it worse in another sense. Like, let's say she didn't do that. Perhaps Silco would have been able to kill all of them. Like, that's possible, right? But perhaps if she didn't do it, then they would have been just fine and none of them would have died. But the way that happened, Vander and the two boys died. So that's clearly, you know, I, I it, it's hard to say, but I mean, that was just absolutely insane the way it played out. Even just the opening scene or the opening moments when this this monster was first revealed and just absolutely took out Benzo. And I, th I originally thought killed Vander, but just, you know, captured him. But the moment that started, when I was already like, this is insane. But this end point here was the last like 10, 15 minutes of this episode is, is mind blowingly good. So I am all in for the show now. I cannot wait to see where the characters go from now on, uh, especially Vi and Powder and the fact that they are separated now. I, I really am curious to see where the story is going to go because I, I, I was not expecting that shit. I, I really like when TV shows do this. I'm not going to spoil other TV shows if you haven't seen them, but just as like an some I'm, I'm actually I'm not going to give examples. I, like I said, I wasn't going to spoil them, but you know what I'm talking about. There's other shows where they'll introduce like a main character right off the bat that's like one of the fan favorites, and then they just kill them off within the first few episodes. I think it's such a good way to get you invested because you're like, holy shit, this show has balls. Like it will do those crazy things. It will go there, and the show does that. And, and I I just I can't believe it happened. I was not expecting it, but it was it was brilliantly done. The, the way it was shot, too, like with, with the animation, it all looks so good. So I am I'm all for it. I just want to watch the next episode now. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Um, oh, yeah, his name was Milo. I was trying to remember what the other the boys names were. It was Milo and Clagger. So, yeah, rest in peace to them. But I, those were insane moments. And I, uh, I really liked uh, Milo. I mean, Clagger was fine, too, but I, I think Milo was uh, a little more interesting. But the fact that they just got killed like that was insane. So uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. I will see you on my next one. Don't forget to check out the Fallout Cut reaction on my Patreon. Peace out, everyone.